Hi, Patrick T here. Welcome to my channel. Today's video, we're shooting outside because we're doing my top five Dolce and Gabbana light blue flankers. Light blue for ohm. Yes. And thank you, all the subscribers, the loyal followers. And if you are new here, please consider clicking this red button over here. That one. Subscribe and hit the notification bell this video is my top 5 Dolce & Gabbana light blue flunkers this is the original light blue it was launched last 2007 it's, this is very successful one of the best seller of all time one of that best seller and this is an award-winning line now we will begin. My top 5 is Light Blue Discovery Volcano. Why did I put this on number 5? Because I was disappointed with this release because the aqua, the aquatic note and the citrus note is not there. They put it into woody and very earthy. They replaced the aquatic note and they replaced the citron note into ginger, lavender, cypress, and vetiver and cedar. That's why this drops to my number five. This is the Discovery Volcano. And I will rate this as five out of ten. Why? Yeah, all of that. Dolce & Gabbana light blue flunkers or series. It's just a uh, summer and spring. So you, this is not all versatile. Every Everything that we are talking here is a summer and a spring fragrance. So why is it 5 over 10? Why is it I rate this 5 to 10? Because they went into the different side. The aqua and the citron note is not there. And I don't like the very strong vetiver and a very strong cypress notes in here. I was expecting I even get a citron, that grapefruit. It's not here. So the, the scent is 5 over 10. The longevity, the performance is 5 over 10. Why is this just 2 hours? And that's it. And the price, 5 over 10 because it's expensive as well. So that is Discovery Volcano, my top five. My top four is Beauty of Capri, Light Blue Beauty of Capri. This was released in last 2016. And the notes here, again, it went to the different side, but there is one citron. There is this, the citron note, they put it back. They put it back, but the, the vetiver and the vetiver and the cedar is there. So you can only beat the DNA of 2007 is not in there. The aqua, the, 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 the grapefruit is not there. So that's why it's just my number four. This is the light blue beauty of Capri. What is my rate on this? Another five over ten. Why? The scent, I don't like it. Bergamot and citrons, opening citrons and bitter. I don't like it until the dry down, and that's it. Long longevity, it's just another two hours to three. So, five the rating is five over ten, and this is my number four Beauty of Capri. My number three is released last 2015, and now this is better. We're talking about the light blue. This is light blue swimming in the fari. Now I am very happy. Why the grapefruit and the aqua overload? Imagine it's like you are in the beach. You are in the beach. All the sea salt note is to die for. Man, that grapefruit, the DNA, the amber brie, and the moss. This is really a masculine um, summer type. The sea salt, that citron, that grapefruit, 
and that sea salt is really toned up amber gray and moss very very nice one one of the best <clears throat> one of the best aqua note this is light blue swimming in lifari what is to rate this i will rate this a six out of ten why in the scent i like it nine out of ten the price five out of ten the longevity five out of ten why the longevity again three hours maximum what happened three hours maximum only three hours i thought it will last long because the dna of grapefruit and the citron in the aquanaut is there only a daytime casual because of the citron one it's just an outdoor fragrance so the rating is six out of ten but i like it they put back all the light blue dna the citron the musky and the aqua note and this is my top three light blue swimming in lifari and my number two is very interesting flunkers of light blue this is the release this is their new release in release in 2019 this is the light blue sun the breakdown of the notes it's here is very interesting that's why i really put my my pocket on the line here when it's released i took it straight away i buy this from the mall not in the this not in the discounter i buy this very expensive because it's new release this is my number two Dolce and Gabbana light blue sun the breakdown of the notes is very good they put every every DNA every notes on the last 2007 they put the bergamot the citrons and the grapefruit there they put the okumos on the moss but they put a lot of new things here a new notes like a like the ginger, the osoni, and the vanilla. You know that smell of vanilla and coconut plus the ozoni clear. It's really amazing, guys. This is this is really to die for. Very nice vanilla, coconut, grapefruit combination plus aquatic notes. Very nice. This is one of the best plunker among the line you know that vanilla opening that grapefruit opening that um, coconut that kicking that coconut was kicking in the dry down is ginger rosemary and vanilla it's really really cool and I give them a 7 out of 10 why I like the scent I give the scent 9 out of 10 and this is performing well four hours four hours sometimes is really when they really a high hit sun five hours so that's this is climbing to the top rating seven out of ten because the longevity is performing a little bit than the others for four hours i get sometimes five hours a very nice vanilla coconut oak moss great pro combination plus that ozone layer one of a good summer set it's a good daily you can put it in the office dress up i mean dress down you can do this and um, you can you can because of dust vanilla you can do it night night and day but it's just a summer and spring this is my number two a seven out of ten uh, light blue flunkers light blue sun and my number one was released last 2017 this was created by my favorite perfumer one of the best perfumer is Alberto Morelas he created a lot of things he created in the Dolce and Gabbana he created a lot of um, Versace he created a lot in Bulgari this is my number one Lanker of light blue released in 2017 this is light blue who intense D 
this is the old intense all they put back all the DNA of the 2017 this is really a best plunker because the 2017 the 2017 they just make it a very intense version the, the orange the grapefruit the sea salt the amber wood and the moss is still there but they're tuning it up making it as an intense blue fragrance sexy elegant summer and spring for men I rate this an 8 out of 10 why last long I am impressed it could last six hours sometimes seven hours it depends with where you are it performs well in the indoor if you are in the high heat very warm but if you are indoor you are in the office you are in the school it performs when you are outdoor that will not good and the projection here is two hours man so this is my number one it project well two hours it performs well longevity six hours plus and the price with 200 that's why i bought this a 200 ml is only 120 dollars with 200 ml the, the the scent and the dna is there you put it back and that's why this is my number one there are two there are two that i don't like um uh, i have a decant that a light blue zest it was released 2000 and 2018 that the the light blue zest i don't like because it's very citrusy overload and the other one is the living in the strawberry the launch of 2012 it's so rare because all of these flunkers are limited edition you cannot find it anywhere else except your you if there is one in your favorite shop or discounter shop or in your favorite mall but i cannot find this anywhere so that's for living in this trombarilli is very hard to find because that is one of the rarest um, among all that which was released in 2012 the zest one I didn't bother to buy it again. I have that before and it's very, very, it, it is very zesty. It's very citrusy. I sold it. After I, I smell it, I sold it straight away. And there is this one. I'm supposed to wait this flunker, this video to this new release because I want to collect all of them. But you know, the breakdown, the 2000, 20 release of light blue i saw the breakdown of the notes man what they are doing called the light blue love by love a 2020 release they will release it on the march i saw the breakdown the breakdown is amber a lot of citron and chocolate and ice cream note marshmallow note and amber so that's really sweet oh my god what are they doing so i didn't bother that's why i put this my top five straight away because i don't want to buy that 2020 because it's the ice cream and marshmallow note this is patrick t saying it's not how you look it's how you smell God bless her. Peace out.